My name is Justin Dobring. I study playwriting and screenwriting, and I primarily uh, consider myself a playwright. I'm an adjunct professor at Western Kentucky University, and I also am a teaching artist at Actors Theatre Louisville, and we take uh, playwriting residencies to high schools in Kentucky and Southern Indiana. I wanted a low residency program, so I came in, sat in on a workshop, and was immediately blown away by the way the faculty was working with the students, the quality of the writing that was coming from the students. I immediately identified with the faculty, too, and I was like, these are working professionals, and they'll, they'll know what, what they're talking about, and um, it, felt like, it felt like home as soon as I was just visiting. I felt welcomed and like part of a family. I really love the, the workshops are set up, and this is the way I teach now, too is that you give, you give positive feedback, that you grow from that. And there's always criticism, because you know, you're always room for improvement, but it's these, identifying like these are strengths in your writing. This is what you're doing that's great. Let's build on that. And before Spalding, I, didn't, I couldn't identify any of those. As a writer, you're not in the mainstream of life, because not people, not many people say, I want to write for a living, this is what I want to do. It's kind of crazy. But here it's embraced, that kind of craziness and that dream and that passion is is like fertile ground for growth here. First semester, I, I, was a, I felt like a writer. I, the, the feedback that I got that was encouraging was, you know, you, this is talented, this is strong, you know, keep focusing on this. And there was so much encouragement, and, and just in those words on the margin, that I felt validated, that my choice to be in this program and to be a writer for, for, as my career was right. The challenges I faced in the program, it was just the challenges of writing, I think sometimes. It was, was sometimes it was with a, with a workload, like working, and I have two kids and a wife, and so you mix all that together, that's, that's a challenge. So time was a challenge. But I'm, I love deadlines because I don't want to disappoint anybody, you know? And so those deadlines, like, helped me focus in and allowed me to, or kind of forced me into a position where I'm gonna do the thing I always said I'm going to do. And then I did, and I was able to keep all my obligations with family and work and still be a writer.